Hey everybody, Dr. Josh Chagoda here. Today we're going to get into scapular winging and what you can do at home to fix this. So first things first, when you see scapular winging, the first thing you're going to notice is uh, with the shirt off typically, you're going to notice that the individual's scapula is lifting up and pointing out like this off the, off the thoracic cage. So it may present with a little bit of anterior and forward and elevated rolled shoulder and as a result you'll see the scapula or the shoulder blade kind of pointing back like this into the back here so it'll kind of look a little bit like this and as a result like I said you're gonna see that lift off the cage so that is really a problem because we have you know these anteriorly rolled shoulders we have the scapula which is thrown off the rhythm of the shoulder and the glenohumeral joint uh, making you at risk for upper back pain, neck pain, shoulder pain, shoulder impingement syndrome, uh, scapular dyskinesis, and all these other issues. So we're going to try to fix that. Um, one key muscle that we're worried about here is the serratus anterior, and that is a muscle that attaches from the ribs to the front portion of that uh, scapula. And so what that really allows it to do is take that wing, winging and it kind of sucks it back to the the thoracic cage or that thoracic wall. So we will show you how to fix that with what we call a push-up plus. There are a lot of different ways to do a push-up plus um, and I'm going to show you just one of them in this position on this table here. So everybody's familiar with a push-up but what is that plus? And I'm going to show you that right here. So the push-up obviously is, you know, and I'm going to be doing this on my knees here, is here. The plus is as you're already locked out, you're gonna here, you're gonna extend. So it's almost like when you see a boxer throw and then they really extend. So I'm gonna kind of show here. That is the plus right there. And you're really engaging the scapula, uh, you know, the serratus anterior and some of the shoulder girdle within that. Uh, there's a lot of other structures that we can work but this is just, just like I said, one exercise that you can do. So we're gonna get into that scapular um, push-up plus area. You, you don't have to do the full push-up, you could just stay here. It protract your shoulders, which means coming forward, and then what you're gonna do is retract them, protract, hold, and retract. And then you can also do it on your knee, on your um, elbows here. You can kinda Protract and retract. Protract and retract. So what you're going to be doing is engaging those shoulder blades to come contract and then you're going to protract that shoulder engaging the serratus anterior and helping that scapular dyskinesis or that winging scapular that is kind of elevated. There are a ton of other muscles that attach from the shoulder girdle all the way from the front, all the way through the back and stuff like that. So it's really going to be important that you not only do the strengthening exercise, but that you do some releases up in the anterior aspects, namely the pec and the trap to help drop that shoulder back, okay? So that is one way and one exercise that you can fix scapular winging uh, with the push-up plus, all right? Thanks guys, I will see you next week for another episode, bye.